Hello Thor and Natalie Portman fans welcome here. When Thor Love and Thunder was initially revealed, Chris Hemsworth's Thor was not the center of attention. Jane Foster, played by Natalie Portman, took the stage immediately after it was announced that her character would not only be returning to the MCU, but would also be harnessing the might of Mjolnir herself. There were no specifics offered as to how it would all play out, and supporters are still in the dark about any information. Jane was seen visiting the place where the legendary hammer was smashed in early set images, prompting many to believe that this may be the moment she receives her new presence. Her character was previously released promotional material that showed her in full outfit, complete with Mjolnir. Furthermore, the hammer appears to be made up of all of Thor's prior weapon's original fractured remains, all patched together and held together by an unknown force. Fans now have a brand new hint as to what to expect when Jane Foster ascends to godhood. A freshly leaked shot from the impending series of Marvel Legends figurines for Thor Love and Thunder has been published according to Reddit user Nashitania, and it gives a new tease as to how Natalie Portman's Jane Foster comes to grip Mjolnir. The description on the back of her figure's packaging mentions that Jane Foster's life is forever changed when she mysteriously comes to possess the hammer Mjolnir, and the power of the mighty Thor. While another Reddit user Speedforce2022 mentions that Thor wields the mighty Stormbreaker against a terrifying new foe. The revised explanations don't include any very detailed facts that fans may have been looking for, but they are still useful. Jane's god-level strength appears to emanate from Mjolnir itself, not from someplace else, as the phrase when she mysteriously comes to possess the hammer Mjolnir suggests. While this hasn't been verified, it's a safe bet that the hammer in her hands is the broken remnants of the one Hela smashed in Thor Ragnarok. But what might prompt the hammer to not just reorganize but select Jane Foster as its successor? Fans will have to wait until July 8 to find out all of the answers when the film opens in cinemas. Hopefully, a trailer for the film will be released before then, showcasing Jane Foster's God of Thunder in all her live-action majesty. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.